Okay. And so um, I think, let me see if I'm, I think I am recording now. So hold on one second. I'm getting things organized on my end. Okay. You guys ready? We're ready. All right. So before you share your vows with each other, I do want to remind you that you are vowing not only to pledge your lives and your love together, but you are vowing not to let circumstances or emotions dictate this commitment as you move into the future. You are vowing to always be there for each other. You are vowing to not divorce one another. You are vowing to have unconditional and sacrificial love towards each other. And so as you make these vows to each other before your parents, and before God, you are making the most sacred vows two people could ever make to one another. So with that understanding, Daniel, I ask you first to look Sydney in the eyes and repeat after me. I, Daniel, take you, Sydney. I, Daniel, take you, Sydney. To be my lawfully wedded wife. To be my lawfully wedded wife. I promise from this day forward. I promise from this day forward to love you and comfort you. To love you and comfort you. Honor and keep you. Honor and keep you. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. And forsaking all others. And forsaking all others. I will keep myself only for you. I will keep myself only for you. So long as we both shall live. So long as we both shall live. And now Sydney, I ask you to look Daniel in the eyes and to repeat after me, I, Sydney, take you, Daniel. I, Sydney, take you, Daniel. To be my lawfully wedded husband. To be my lawfully wedded husband. I promise from this day forward. I promise from this day forward. To love you and comfort you. To love you and comfort you. Honor and keep you. Honor and keep you. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. And forsaking all others. And forsaking all others. I will keep myself only for you. I will keep myself only for you. So long as we both shall live. So long as we both shall live. Now I want you to take a look at the rings that are about to be on your fingers. Mm -hmm. They are much more than pieces of jewelry that will tell others that you're married. But they are pieces of jewelry to tell you that you're married, to remind you of the vows you have just made. They are symbolic of those vows, in fact. The tested metal is a reminder of the sacrificial love that you have committed to each other, and the unending circle is a reminder of the unending love that you have committed to each other. So I ask you, Daniel, if you first will place Sydney's ring on her ring finger. Look her in the eyes and repeat after me. I give you this ring as a symbol of my vow. I give you this ring as a symbol of my vow. And with all that I am. And with all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. I honor you. I honor you. And Sydney, if you will mm -hmm. take Daniel's ring and place that on his ring finger, look him in the eyes and repeat after me. I give you this ring as a symbol of my vow. I give you this ring as a symbol of my vow. And with all that I am. And with all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. I honor you. I honor you. So now, Daniel and Sydney, because you have declared your love and commitment to each other, you have made sacred vows, you've exchanged rings to symbolize those vows. It is my honor to pronounce that you are now husband and wife. And Daniel, you may kiss your beautiful bride. Love you. Thank you. Thank you, Scott. Yes, let me be the first to congratulate you and to introduce you, at least to your parents at this point <laughs> in time as Mr. and Mrs. Daniel Serrano. <laughs>